I want to give you a little pep talk on what to do if you're in the middle of a speed workout or towards the end of the speed workout and you're really having problems. First of all, the largest number of cases that I deal with deal with heat. And so if it's a hot day and you're not hitting the times or you're having to really struggle badly to hit the right times for your workout pace goal, then uh, cut the distance of your repetition in half and run twice as many of them. Usually that will allow you on a hot day to reach your goals. For example, if it's one mile repeats that you're doing and training for a faster marathon, do twice as many 800 meter or half mile repetitions. And you could take a little bit of extra walking in between. And if it's a hot day, bring out an ice chest full of ice water. And in between your walk break, when you're uh, resting between the repetitions, pour water over the top of your head. It's amazing how refreshing that is and how that'll cool everything off. If there are other issues with your not being able to finish a speed workout, uh, analyze whether it's an injury issue. And if it is, it is best to stop that workout immediately. If it's not uh, an injury and you have some other issues, then the next time you do an interval or speed workout, then take the first few repetitions much easier at race pace or a little bit slower and then build into the workout pace that's usually about 30 seconds per mile faster than you want to run in your race itself. So, uh, take these actions and you can resuscitate a speed workout that started to go bad and stay in the program.